In our CNN study finds Democrat leaning kids five times more likely to say they won't visit pro Trump family's house. Donald Trump, he did bad things. He's like Hitler, one 10 year old boy said. Now, over 40 years of uh, 40 hours of interviews with 10 year olds in multiple states concluded that children who support former President Trump are more willing to visit the houses of families with, uh, with opposing views than their Democratic leaning counterparts. Researchers found that. Democrats supporting kids grow polarization in a new study CNN reported on Thursday suggesting that while Democratic leading kids are more willing to discriminate against Trump supporters, kids in red states are more likely to repeat misinformation. The findings were gleaned from more than 40 hours of interviews commissioned by CNN's Anderson Cooper 360 interviewing 80 elementary schools in Arizona, New Jersey and Texas. The interviews uh, done with parents or guardians approval were conducted in both the spring before uh, President Biden re relinquished the nomination and fall long after Vice President Kamala Harris took the baton. In both seasons, Arizona State University Associate Professor, Child Development Expert and Media Psychologist Ashley Landrum spoke with the children and noticed some key differences between respondents. Now, Democrat-leaning kids were approximately nine times more likely or 800% uh, more likely to express negative emotions, nervous or worried or angry or frustrated about Donald Trump than Republican-leaning kids were likely to express about Kamala Harris, the study explained. CNN host Anderson Cooper summarized on his show that overall the biggest finding was that children in the study were polarized with what researchers called more extreme responses from the blue state kids than the red state kids.